the one and only exclusive. And new details about a suspect accused of taking photos of a man inside the restroom at a South Florida store. Police say he may be behind two disturbing cases, and now we're seeing video of him. Local 10's Rosh Lowe has a closer look. What a disturbing story. As I mentioned yesterday when we covered this, you expect some privacy when you go to the bathroom, not pictures or video. Now we have very clear video of the suspect. It's the first time we are seeing this guy on video and he's looking for the lavatory. And this is a story all about pictures and video in the bathroom. That's right. Take a look at the guy. Cops are investigating whether this guy is taking his photography skills into bathroom stalls, snapping shots of men. Let's take you to Fort Lauderdale in February. The guy in the white walks into the Home Depot and cops say he makes himself at home in the bathroom for a while. That's when our victims say cops sitting on the toilet looks up out of the report. It says he stated as he looked up, he saw a cell phone camera being held over him. He stated he observed that the person in the number three stall that was filming him was wearing red socks and sandals. I'd be going to a manager as soon as possible and trying to get that figured out because that's not good at all. And that's what happened. It took the victim, say police, about 30 seconds to get out of the bathroom. So the suspect had a head start. Here it appears an employee is running after him, but he gets away. And here's the truck police say he was driving. And cops fear this was not an isolated case. Coconut Creek police put out this photo of a case in April. Very similar details. A guy getting his picture taken in the bathroom. But now police releasing this video, hoping someone recognizes this man. Cops believe he may frequent the Home Depot for all the wrong reasons. Okay, if you recognize this guy, such clear video, pick up the phone and call Crime Stoppers in Broward County. That number is 954 493 tips a disturbing case and remember once again we have two different agencies looking into this in fort lauderdale i'm rosh Lowe, local 10 news